Good morning, this is my Shaman Oracle reading for this new week. Today is Tuesday and today I'm reading for Leo, Virgo, Libra and Scorpio. And this reading here is for Virgo. Welcome Virgo. I'm using six card decks and the reading starts once more with the Wild Unknown Archetypes deck. Out came the card, the lover and the lover is the heart is the beloved and is the devoted the lover is pulsing through the heart of gratitude the lover appreciates and experiences the world through the senses Reveling in beauty, in song, in art, in music, in sense, and also in sensuality. So this energy awakens as the tip of our tongue when we taste the sweetness of honey, of a kiss, of a lover, or we speak gentle words to a child. So the lover lingers in foreplay, aroused, but not yet by getting there, but by slow merging of the self and the other. So this energy is usually experienced for short periods of time, as in order to feel it, we must be fully present and awake with no expectations or rules about what should be. Rather, the lover is in awe of what the world presents, reveling in the glorious details and grateful to savor every last drop of life's offerings. The lover archetype is present everywhere in your life, not just where conventional forms of pleasure and beauty are found, and the lover's awe is unconditional. When you hold someone's gaze for several moments, you will feel the lover within you awaken. It is common to seek the lover in another, but true gift is to find the lover in yourself. The good tarot card that came out is the Seven of, seven of Fire. The Seven of Fire is your personal best, going the distance, perseverance, and non conformity. See this? I am unstoppable. My passion pushes obstacles aside as I engage in sustained effort. I know how to bend, but I do not compromise on what is most important to me. If others are not happy with the course I am on, I do not have to let their concerns affect me. I release the temptation to resist challenges and I trust that I can make things happen as I live life on my own terms. Inspired solutions, they present themselves to me. The Dungeons and the Dragons card that came out for you is justice. Your capacity to create a new reality through shattering old and limiting beliefs. And the special message is that a poor villager comes to you seeking your aid and offers you a rare magic item in compensation. The Goddess Temple card that you got is 
Ryanan. And Ryanan, she brings you full self awareness, knowledge of your body, and pleasure, openness of heart, healing of emotional wounds, sensuality, and receptivity. Ryanan teaches you to live your sexuality in a healthy, harmonious, free, and conscious manner. The Medicine Woman card that came out is empowerment. And empowerment is about to assert yourself and shine your power and do this now. A woman's true value is a jewel waiting to shine. Even today, women's self-confidence, they remain unconquered territory. And this is due to the patriarchal system in which a woman's relationship to men as their protector, predator or work supervisor has deeply inscribed in them feeling dependent on the man financially, physically and also socially. Although this is beginning to change, that ancestral imprint is still present. So a new step is now presenting itself to us the opportunity to contact our feminine power and to take back our leadership. The guidance here is that your new goal is your empowerment. Cultivate the profound conviction that as a woman you represent a factor of positive change to build a more loving respectful and environmentally protective world. What challenge must you take up to take your place and to show your ambition? What great project do you dream of? It is time to free yourself from old models and participate fully in this world. Your new your new aces, they are following your intuition, valuing your emotions and relying on authenticity and collective intelligence. So assert yourself and let your powers shine now. Do the medicine action success journal practice to strengthen your gifts and gain in your self-confidence, begin by identifying them and learn to celebrate your victories, the large ones as well as the small ones. Do not apologize for your successes and learn to congratulate yourself. If a compliment comes your way, Welcome it and feel it. Feel your energy beaming with gratitude and practicing empowerment highlights the importance of pointing to what makes you shine. Now decide to take back your personal power by positively signposting this process and the progress you have already made, you will shine light on, on your strong points, what makes you unique, and increase your self-esteem. And the last card is the Sacred Traveler card. It is Infinite Abundance. Abundance is pouring into your life. The card's meaning is that everything is blossoming 
and bearing fruit now. So open yourself to receive the prosperity you seek is being activated, a stream of abundance in all areas of your life is ready to flow into your life even more so. The Creator desires that you prosper, so take action in the direction of your dreams. This is not a time to passively wait for prosperity to fall into your lap. The sacred traveler wants you to know life gets and goes in cycles. There are times when the fields lay fallow and there are also times of the harvest. Right now you are moving toward a harvest time to receive an outpouring of money, energy, time and or love. However, you must first know that you deserve it and you do. There are times on the journey when life is fallow, but in the times of harvest, the secret traveler shares the bounty and even volunteers to help others bring in their crops. This is the time to give deeply and fully of who you are and what you have. For the more you truly give, the more you will receive. It is a universal law. As you focus on gratitude for what you already have, your abundance will grow leaps and bounds. That was your reading, Virgo. I surely hope you liked it. I thank you for listening. I do wish you a most beautiful day today. I surely wish you a most wonderful whole week. Take care and goodbye.